Hey, what's up, everybody? How's it going? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? Place two. This place. That guy and this guy. Going back to 2022. With some, yeah, set boosters of the flying hamster. Somebody said, Hey, Dave, you know what's really entertaining and fun to do? Go back and open a box of absolute hot garbage and <laughs> see if it changed at all in two years. So, choink! And I here are going to open this set box from 2022. How is this set aged? The Commander Legends Dungeons and Dragons Baldur's Gate. Well... Personal opinion, I still need a hot turd. There are some cards in here that are holding value. Not many over a $5 mark at current value in their basic form. But there are a few gems, like the dragons, that are in here that apparently seem okay. And remember, this is a uh, set that can be used with the companion and the community and... Um, no blue core, so it's fake. It's all fake. It's all going to zero. It's all hot garbage. So we'll open it and see what we get. Okay. Let's go. For the sake and brevity of the purposes, I'm going to skip the uh, nonsense of the Undercity. And say, well, these packs are backwards. So from the front, you're going to have an art card. Have some lands, and then I think these are our yes. So they're going to get the commons, and then we're going to go to the uncommons. So we have a, uh, a. These also did come with the etched, the foil etched cards. We got the Eldritch Pact right off the rip. A Zildor of the Ilven here. Eh. Okay. I'm not even trying to pronounce some of these names because it's 11 o'clock here. I really don't feel like doing it. Art card. Let's see. <laughs> We're looking for not hot garbage. Well, devour the Tiamat, legendary creature, Livian, a skeleton. On the city. Oops. Art card. Oh, let's see. <laughs> I do like the Gate Colossus. It's kind of a fun card. Will. Mazzy. A Jan Jansen Crafter and a Foil Cap. <coughs> Hamtaro. Hamster. The Hamsterino. The Hamster Elijah. Ooh, a dragon! Uh, art card. Let's see. Val. Stunkin. Uji. The criminal pact. There is a dragon. Not the dragon we're looking for. But it's Ganax. Ganax. Robe of the Archmage. Winter. Eldrin. Okay. Cool. We have a really good stock of this at the shop. So, oh, look, that there's a signed one. That's cool. So, that's a dollar. Maybe. There's a Ginax regular. Uh huh. Uh huh. Master Chef. That's me. Battle of the Angels. Tur. Mythic. Uh, mm, saviors. And a foil devour. Okay. Mythic and a couple rare pack. Not really what we're looking for, but still, it was a couple good hits in a row. An all jank. Art card. And command your pair. Nemesis Phoenix. A phone. Is it Phoenix or Phoenix? I like Phoenix. 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 Gorion. Master Chuff again. The Feywild Visitor. Council of Four. Beckon on a wisp and a list card of the noxious toad from Portal. Okay. Let's 
so many list cards I don't get, but maybe at some point it might be fun just to play with a deck of just only list cards. Only build it with list cards. The Seagate. Mm -mm. Noble Heritage. Nr. Wild Maje. Wizards of Thy. The Foil Basilisk Gate. Down to the bottom of the first stack. Remember, there's only 20 some packs in here. Not a lot. This was a premium set. Premium, they said. Premium. All the best jank. Nine fingers. The Vicona Drow Apostle. Baba. And Lohan. Okay. Well, well, well. No. Another gold sign card. Not the dollar. There's a Wilson. Hey, actually, a Wilson is something we need. We're kind of out of Wilsons. Let's see if there's anything here. Let's see. There's Raphael. There's Gorion. Or even off Adventurer. And a Gutsworn Prowler. There's a Wilson art card. Mm, lurking green dragon. Unfortunately, not the good dragon we're looking for. Cordlessa. Bane. Nature's lore. And a, another list card. Over Confront the Past, which is a... Nope, not a flip card. It's not a flip card. The heck? Oh, Strixhaven, that's why. It's a Strixhaven one of the schools. Yeah, we're that much still into the point that Strixhaven now is making list cards? This was 2022, and that's a list card in 2022. Okay, sure, Wizards. Um, yeah. <clears throat> How to play the game card. Nobody actually even plays these. Like, this is crazy. There's actually this thing here that says, uh, roll for initiative and how to do it and how to get ready and how to play it. Um... So it tells you how to play, and nobody ever plays that that, that sort of mini games. Art card. Arcane Signet. Huh, okay. Electrona Drow. Duke, Duke, Duke of Poop. Sword Coast Sailor. Charlatan. And the Orb of Dragon Kind. Uh, Ed Red. If it's mana spent for a dragon, gains haste until no turn. Whoopee. Remember, this is Dungeons and Dragons. Not a whole heck of a lot of anything dungeon mechanic wise. Just this silly Undercity. We have three dungeons, four dungeons now, I think, that we can play in. We did a lot of custom ones here, if you guys remember from back in the day when AD&D first came out. Our custom dungeons were bomb diggity. People liked them, some people hated them. I tried to make them fun, that was the whole point. Remember what it is? Oh, there's another Wilson. Remember what it was? People having fun. That's what we're trying to do here. We're trying to have fun. I'm having fun. Are you having fun with Will's reversal? And uh, Corlassa? Yeah. Having lots of fun. Ooh, so much fun. All the fun to be had here. Let's see. Dragon Art Cart. Mazzy, Flaming Fist, the Flautist, the Navigation Orb, and a Lava Born Muse list card from way back in a day of, uh, oh yeah, that's not so far back. <sighs> Throw in a Veldrain. We're approaching the 100th set of magic. I believe that's 100 sets of magic now. Coming up in, uh, Oh, the, um, <clears throat> the Ram Ranch set with all the Cowboys versus Eldrazi's or whatever it is. It's going to be, it's going to be epic. I, I really am not so sure yet. I haven't seen any of the spoilers, but it's only three weeks away and we've not seen a single spoiler other than three cards from it. Hmm. What's that tell you? It's either going to be poo poo doo doo shoo doo doo cock a doo doo boo 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 poo poo or they're trying to, how many can boo card? 
Well, they're trying to, like, hold the hype back, because they're trying to get rid of all the rest of the stuff they have in the previous two sets of Poo Poo Shadoo. We have a Tavern Brawler, and Gil's Redirection, and the Infinite Blade, and a Flutter Fox. Again, another list card from Throne of Eldraino. Which actually was a very decent set. I, I think that set's going to age very well. It was a lot of fun. I was very surprised at uh, how much I liked it. I didn't think I was going to, but I did. Art card. Uh, lightning Bolt. Always good for a dollar. Fireball. And Zolvor. Another Cyan. Another Gale. The Thirst. And a Poison the Blade. We only have two packs left here. Well... I am underwhelmed. I don't know if you are, but this has been exactly what I expected it was going to be. Lackluster, boring, and not a single dragon of any value to make this box worthwhile cracking. Nope. Last pack of magic. Here we go. A of minutes and 15 seconds so far of my life wasted on opening stuff that... I don't really need to open, but somebody thought it'd be fun, so let's open some stuff, alright? We got a ball, Cultus the Absolute, Guild Artisan, Kindred Discovery, we a reprint, but it's like the only hit we've had so far, and a starring bard and a copy. Alright, well, <laughs> the fun fund is officially bankrupt, so on that note, coming up soon, Outlaws of Thunder Junction, we have a pre-release. And a pre-release, and a pre-release, and oh, there's a Frank and Beans competition. So you can bring a crock pot of your best hot dogs and beans recipe, share it with everybody, you get five bucks off the pre-release. Five bucks. Five. Uno, dos, tres, something, cinco. VIP event. $69 giggity dollars. Includes up a $33 value at Texas Roadhouse, promptly at 3 p.m., on April the 13th, followed by a sealed deck tournament back at Flights. This place. Then on Sunday, we have a high noon. <whistles> Showdown. Again, with Frank and Beans, Chefy Smell Contest. And then Wednesday, at 7 p.m., we have Brawl. So what you can do is you can take any commander you want, like any legendary, of the, you know, whatever out of this stack, or out of whatever you have at home. And you can bring it in, but you can only use cards from the new Outlaws of Blunder Dysfunction. The set coming out on April 12th for pre-release. We'll have it. And we'll be back to you soon with a uh, little preview of the box opening of some collector boosters. Giggity, giggity. Thanks, y'all. Peace.